Welcome to Union Talk. What's up, Union brothers and sisters out there? Welcome to Union Talk. Uh, I just want to bring you this video. Uh, I missed out last week on bringing you all a video, but I don't want to short you guys. So I'm bringing this one to you, and I want to start off first by saying RIP to Kobe Bryant. Uh, we lost a good player out there yesterday in the sports world. Uh, I'm sure a lot of you all know him. A lot of you all were supporters, fans of him, fans of the Lakers and things of that nature. Wanted to just say RIP to him again. And I'm bringing you this for, you know, the non-sports people because Union Talk is not just for the automotive unions uh this platform is for all union members worldwide and i just wanted to let you all know about you know the nba i've got my notes here they actually have what they call the national basketball players association which it's a labor union that represents basketball players it was founded in 1954 the headquarters are in new york and it was founded by two guys. One guy that, you know, you sports fans or supporters may know, a man by the name of Bob Cousy, and also a man by the name of Larry, and I hope I'm saying his last name correctly, Fleischer, Larry Fleischer. And actually, the uh, Basketball Players Association Labor Union is actually the oldest trade union of the four major American, North American professional sports. It was, like I said, it was founded in 1954. And that's a union for basketball players. That, that uh, particular one there, the National Basketball Players Association, that is the one for them. I just wanted to bring this to you all and, uh, you know, let you all know about the different unions out there. Like we have the electricians, we have pipe fitters. I just want to reiterate that union talk is not just for automotive. It's not just for the big three or anything like that. This channel is for unions across the board, worldwide. And with that, uh, like I said, this is just a short one. I just wanted to show my respects to Kobe Bryant, uh, send my condolences out to his wife and his other three girls because his 13 year old daughter was on the helicopter in, in the helicopter with him when this, uh, tragedy happened. And, uh, I took some time and you know just thought about it and it's like what do you say to you know your child who you are here to protect what do you say to them when something like this is going on when you know you can't help them so i also want to let you all know out there you know with things like this we always say come together and do things like that but let's just start today and let's try to do it every day hug your loved ones tell them you love them you know because you never know when your number is called you know you never know when you're going to leave this earth so you know and anything that you have going on out there just set that aside and and try to come together because family is all you have at the end of the day and especially if you have children like i said you're, we are here to protect them and make sure they're safe and, and try to guide them through life and help them make decisions. And I just wanted to speak on that for a second and, and that's about it. And just wanted to, you know, reiterate that this platform right here is for all unions across the board. And uh, thank you, Kobe Bryant, for the 20 years you put in the league with one team it's not a lot of uh players that do that anymore especially in this era it seems like it's all about win 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 and everyone is chasing the ring and kobe chased the ring and he got a few of them 
But when the Lakers weren't doing good, he still stayed with them. So I want to give a big shout out to you. And uh, like I said, condolences to your family and the other families of people who, uh, you know, were lost on that helicopter uh, flight. And uh, peace, and I'll see y'all at the end with the shout outs. And here we are at the end. This one was short. Uh, first off, I'm at the end. You all know what I do. I send my shout outs. But first, I want to give a big shout out to the National Players Association. Basketball Players Association. I'm sorry. The National Basketball Players Association. The Labor Union for the basketball players out there. I want to give a big shout out to you all first. And RIP to Kobe Bryant. R.I.P. to Kobe Bryant one more time. Okay, and let's take a moment of silence for him. And here we are with my shout outs. And I'm going to start with local 1853 in Tennessee. Local 31 in KCK, Local 2209 in Indiana, Local 249 in the MO, Local 2250 in the MO. Who else we got out there? Local 1112, Lordstown, Ohio, Local 598 in Flint, Michigan, Local 602, Lansing, Michigan, Local 276 in Arlington, Texas, and last but not least, Local 2164 in Bowling Green, Kentucky, the home of the Corvette. Peace. Thank you for watching. Make sure you subscribe.